Good morning, gamers. How are you doing? The world scares me at the moment, I can't lie, guys. I know we got wars, we got all this, that, and the other. But one thing they're trying to do is stop you having your opinion. You are not allowed to even think without having some idiot tell you that you're wrong or that you're a racist or that you're a piece of shit. And now what I'm seeing here is absolutely shocking and it's scary as fuck. The best thing Elon Musk ever did for society was buy Twitter, or X now as it's called. And I'll tell you why, boys and girls. Because if you notice on other platforms, you're not allowed to actually express your opinion now unfortunately free speech is hard to come by these days apparently if you don't believe in you know if you don't make it clear that you're not a racist bigot a sexist a moron then people will assume you are elon musk has bought twitter which basically allows people to express their opinions now just like in normal life there are people with dumbass opinions you know you speak to someone and you just stare at them and go i can't believe you've made it this far in life don't you there's the same here you cannot believe some of the shit people put on the internet but they do all right if you want it one way you got to have it both ways. You can't control it. Let's see what this absolute witch had to say. Why does it look like my fucking testicles have recorded it? Elon Musk has no social conscience or conscience whatsoever. I don't know whatever whatever Elon Musk is on that says that that's okay to continue to air that is absolutely disgusting behaviour. And quite frankly, the bloke should be jailed. <laughs> the bloke should be jailed. You know, I'm not sure what this woman's talking about, but it's about that church, you know, uh, tragedy, that disgusting thing that happened. But it was filmed, and like everything that's filmed, it ended up on the internet now elon musk said he's not going to take it down because the people deserve to see it or something like that now personally yeah I, I get it's not a nice video but at the same time she has no right to tell people what they can and can't view you know it's like who are you who are you who are you she's trying to control free speech in other countries what they can view no you are no one no one knows your fucking name that we can bring rules in or do something about this sort of um uh, this sort of game playing with our social media, um, the better off we're going to be. But quite frankly, the power that that man has um, because of that platform that he's on, it's got to stop. It has absolutely got to stop. You know, she's always shouting out like she's like he's the kingpin, you know what I mean? Or like he's Adolf's cousin reincarnated. He is saving us by allowing free speech to continue. People are going to have opinions you don't like. That's life. If you got to the fucking age where you look like that and you still get annoyed by everything people say, then I am sorry, but I have no time for you. I hope you fall in the bin and get taken to the tip and get put in them big piles of shit and get lost and sink to the bottom and live there for eternity and become like brown in Game of Thrones when he's like glued to a tree or some shit. That's what I hope happens to you. And look, I'm very passionate about this because I think Pete, Elon Musk gets a bad rap for no reason. I'm not an Elon Musk fan. I don't have a Tesla. I don't want his AI chip. I don't exactly think Twitter's the best thing ever, but I think it's good because it gets information and information that's fake. You know, when like me, me, news and media lie and bullshit. Well, Twitter points it out. They say there is no evidence of this. They have community notes. You know this, that and the other. All right? That's the best thing that he could have brought in. He's trying to create a basically a free speech platform that everyone has access to doesn't matter if you're white black gay straight female no gender man ape chimpanzee gorilla whatever you are if you have thumbs in a phone or the internet you can access it but the prime minister of australia so i'm gonna do this and i'm gonna sound like this all right going here's fucking no one why do you fucking you fucking drag out wagon gun labels elon musk an arrogant billionaire thinks he is above the law he's not above the law all right it's criticized just i'm gonna stop this the ex owner who criticized australian authorities demanding videos of sydney church stopping be removed australian prime minister basically labeled him an arrogant billionaire who thinks he's above the law which you know i think all billionaires probably have a a slight inkling that they're above the law you know i don't think it's just elon himself i think elon's actually pretty level-headed and is interested in saving well saving you know helping humanity for the better i don't think he's some evil iron man villain or something like that i genuinely genuinely or generally i don't know the answer he might be you know on the good side so uh on monday night in an urgent federal court with court ordered a two-day injunction against extra high post globally containing the footage of a stabbing which you can't do you can't control what everyone sees everywhere this e-safety commission had proved directed extra to remove the post but X had blocked them from access in Australia pending allegiance. So which is good. You cannot control what other people see or say or think or do. All right, it's a horrible video. No one wants to see it, but it's there. You shouldn't have filmed, you know, a man giving a speech. You shouldn't have allowed him to get so close. This guy, you, you know, had a knife on him. And he's saying he's chosen ego and shown violence over common sense. It's just ridiculous. It's just him taking this out of precaution. And the worst part is I love my parents and, you know, the elderly or whatever. But they're going to read this and actually believe it. You know, it's, they're brainwashed. The old people aren't able to think for themselves. It's 
only the young fucking, what we call, we're not boomers, we're the other ones. We are the ones who can think for ourselves because we are know the BS that the media and the internet have. He, he's So he's basically trying to say it like he's, he's fighting to show violent videos. It's like, no, you can't control what other countries view and see and do and deal with. Elon Musk, here's the issue. The issue is that Australia appears to be demanding censorship of content on X beyond its borders. You have no right. This is exactly the issue. Should they say it's an unelected official as well in Australia have authority over all countries on Earth? The answer is fucking no. They shouldn't. You shouldn't have any control over anything over Earth other than yourself. So that Jack Wee, Jackie Lambie, who's the most irrelevant woman on the planet, uh, basically told everyone to boycott uh, Twitter. And by everyone, she means like 200 politicians. Like, oh no, Twitter's going to lose politicians tweeting. It, it would only make it a better place. Please get the fuck off the platform. Your opinions are shit and mean nothing to anyone. No one reads them and thinks, oh, thank God. Here we go. Jackie Lambie's fucking tweeting again. No, mate, leave the platform. Go. It's a place for free speech. It's a, a place where there's going to be horrible opinions. You don't have to agree with them. There's going to be good opinions that you do agree with. There's going to be opinions you don't care about. There's going to be funny videos. There's going to be horrible videos. There's going to be pe videos of people dancing. There's videos of people dying. That's just what the internet is and it's all on X. All right. I can't tell you how many times I'm scrolling through and I see some weird, you know, anime like porn. I have to quickly swipe. I don't know why that's there. I have on my account no naughty images. You know what I mean? Like turn all that shit off. It still appears. I'm not logging in on my shit. Fuck Elon Musk. I've had to see a cartoon booty. Like, no, it's actually quite pleasant. <laughs> I joke. Look, this lady and her eyebrows need to fucking leave. That's all I'm going to say, all right? I know you shouldn't be mean about people's appearances, but when you're telling other people to boycott these, these businesses and that they're trying to control what you think in a different country and what you can see, nah, mate, absolutely do one. I hope the sharks around your countries chew you to death because that is not for you to decide and it's not for you to have any sort of opinion of you. Someone like that should be put in jail and the key be thrown away. That bl that bloke, that bloke should not have the right to be out there on his own I I ideology ideology I ideology platform creating hatred he's not creating hatred there is hatred in the world all right there's always going to be hatred in the world and it's sad there's always going to be people who hate what you there's always going to be people who hate certain beliefs and opinions unfortunately you have no right to stop them from talking that is their right what we can do is we can try educate change reform you can't tell them to shut the fuck up and they're not allowed to do things as long as they don't in you know attack and hurt and do anything like that unfortunately there's always going to be idiots the difference is the internet has allowed these idiots to be more prevalent and more have ugh, a bit biggest say on things you know what i mean like you anyone can have an opinion jerry in your old maths class who you know brought a gun up his ass crack every day and black hair and had a massive cut on his cheek that he did right in front of you with his protractor he can have an opinion and says i hate fucking gay people it doesn't mean he's true you know you no know, there's nothing wrong with gay people there's something wrong with you mate and that's my opinion the same way that that was your opinion it doesn't mean your opinion you can't have it that's your opinion what i can do is try oh why is that your opinion or maybe let's try help each other because that's a silly opinion you know it's, it's not about Oh, this guy's a fucking bigot. I hate cheese puffs. Oh, right, get him back. Get him off Twitter. No one. Cheese puffs are the best. No one can ever complain about cheese puffs. Anyway, I'm just waffling about cheese puffs at the moment, but it's scary. It actually annoys me and it should anger you that people like this in power think they have, not even most, these women, that they have power over other people because of what you can think and what you can do and what you can see. Not on my what sunshine. And thank God Elon Musk owns Twitter, ladies and gentlemen. I think it's one of the best things to happen to the human race and I'm not even being dramatic. I understand that, you know, vaccines, whatever. Nah, bro, the vaccine will kill you. Elon Musk won't, unless, you know, his planes, his massive airships explode and then potentially and i'm not getting his ai chip fuck that shit that's that's literally a horror film i've seen it in so many tv shows it ends so poorly i'm running out of breath i'm running out of life goodbye good night good luck